But what happens is that many times I have seen they make exceptions. So you can basically become the part of that exceptions. I have seen similar kind of excuse was used by one of my friend also. So generally big companies like Accenture, Infosys, everything, right? They have a three, three months notice period, right? Are you feeling trapped in your current company and you are looking for a early relief or early escape? Many times we join a particular company and there is a new opportunity that we are basically, we want, right? For example, we have a remote opportunity. We want, we are getting a higher package in the next company, right? So what we want is we want a early release, right? So many times people have this notice period, which is like 90 days and all, right? So how you can use these five tips to get a early escape from your current job, right? These are the important tips that I have basically, you can say consolidated from my 12 years experience as a QA, right? This will be very helpful. And I've seen people tried it. These are the so couple of them are real examples, which I'm going to share how you can basically get a early relief from the current job. So it can be used if you have a 90 days of period if you get some better decisions or you get a better opportunity or for example many times i have seen my students especially right they are switching job because they are getting remote work opportunity as compared to the work from office so you can try all of that okay so let's get started the first one is basically task which is very very important i think uh when you think that there is a right time that you should talk to your manager openly honest discussion with your manager okay let them know that okay yes i am basically looking for a particular role and i think i am not able to contribute into the current company and that's why i want to basically do it and you can basically propose a timeline that box works for you like okay let's do one thing uh i uh, it can be like 30 days or 40 days where i will be working in and after that i will basically able to communicate right Co honest and open conversation with manager basically helps and the second important point that you can use second one of the uh, thing that i generally used also right which is the urgent line decision you can say that okay i'm getting married so i remember when i was in the censure right uh there was i am pretty much sure it was a three months notice period guys and i'm talking uh, i'm basically discussing right now because it is a long back story but again uh three months notice periods were there and i was able to do it within the 30 days how because i told them okay there was a urgent decision for example uh there i told them okay in my hometown there is a marriage going on i have to get married and everything right so these things i thought this is true for my myself only i mean this is one of the case but again i have seen similar kind of excuse was used by one of my friend also so generally big companies like accenture infosys everything right they have a three three months notice period notice period right Automation is the need of the hour. This is a wake up call for the manual testers. If you want to convert to automation, job ready automation tester batch is now live. Four months live batch, Saturday, Sunday. We are going to learn about core Java, API automation and web automation. Link is in the description. Do check it out. All the projects are live with the 24 seven doubt sessions on sd.club. Check out the more details. But what happens is that many times I have seen they make exceptions. So you can basically become the part of that exceptions. You can give them that or there is an urgent life decision like for example there is a marriage going on i need to move this x city urgently because there is a, some task that i that has been allocated to me right or you there was one person i know uh, who got a very early relief in a sense i think within a week or two he uh, he told that okay uh, i have a psychological problem and somehow he was able to manage a, a, some of the papers and everything and they relieved him immediately so there are couple of methods that you can try out again i'm not responsible for that you are uh, responsible for this but i have I'm just giving you some real examples, which basically works. Third number, which is, uh, which I think very, very important. So when I was leaving the company, right, I offered a trained replacement. Okay. I said, okay, I'm leaving this company within the 30 days. So let me do one thing. Let me hire, let me basically help you to hire a person and I will train that person. Right. So I have trained a particular intern. I think there was an intern or proper intern, right? I provided a strong recommendation that this person will be helpful for us in the same project. He will be able to re replicate whatever it is. You can express a gratitude that, okay, thank you for this thank you that you have basically made my uh, notice period less right you can basically say that and to offer flexibility that okay uh, you can assure him that okay even after 30 days i will be available if there is any urgent thing required that is a very uh, important thing and i think if you are that person right your manager will definitely help you to reduce those number i have seen it right good relationship with manager actually helps in this case if you want to get a early relief from the current job right if you have a uh, leaves which you have not used or you or you have unused leaves right you can definitely tell them okay Okay, uh, I need to use it right now to reduce my number of uh, notice period. This is where I have seen multiple times. It works in very early company. One of the important thing, if you want early relief from the job, right? Make sure you make your decision very, very early. For example, suppose there is a 90 days period, right? And you are pretty much sure that, okay, you will get a new job within this, right? So what you can do is that you can basically, I have seen many times, which basically works like this. People exactly do it on Nokri.com, on LinkedIn.com, right? What they do is that they mention their notice period as 30 
30 days after 30 for within the 30 days when they have an interview right so they clear the interview and they just mentioned that it is negotiable right after that what what they so whenever when the hr go to know that okay you have a 90 days of notice period right then they basically give you a particular options for example they will say that okay can you do buyback can you buy back like 45 days so that i can complete within the 5 45 days or they try to negotiate with the new hr because see new hr it is very easy that you can basically convince them old hrs will basically generally are not comfortable in reducing the uh, notice period time or early relief that that that's what i have seen so even when i remember there was one of my friend who had 90 days of period right uh, for the notice period right for 30 days it was a around uh, there was an interview after that he th- he immediately resigned so started early immediately resigned at the time and he basically told to the uh, next hr that okay it will take little time because uh, i have to negotiate so he properly negotiated and done this exercise smartly and one important thing is that sometimes uh, 30 days or 90 days uh, notice period uh, didn't work where they just roll back your uh, offer letter right so what you need to do is that you can all you can you always have a option to go back i have seen many uh, i think few of my friends who basically rolled back to the same company because of the 90 days period and there was next company who was not ready to take those uh, to take uh, because basically they are not ready for the 90 days right so again it's a risk that you are taking but again you are getting a reward also so it's a risk and reward so overall conclusion which i am trying to say is that the most important one i think if you can give a urgent life decision that is important talk to your manager if you have a very good relationship with manager right you can get early retirement 100% it is possible i have tried it many of my friends have also tried it but don't piss off your manager that is the most important thing right you don't have to become a enemy of your manager you have to be become a very friendly express gratitude right if if he is reducing your uh, efforts or he is reducing your days right you can what you can say that okay uh, i will basically help you to train a replacement right or any intern you are hiring i will basically will be helping for you this case right you can try that okay thanks for watching this video i hope this helps i'll see you in the next video bye